fancy instrument that I'm not quite sure what it was. Can't tell. Might have been a sax, might have not. Might have been something better. Ron Boone has hustled down from his TV spot and dropped his jazz mask, thrown on his headset, and is ready for the shoot-around report somehow. Is it that time already? It is that time already, <laughs> Ron Boone. But here, Ron, I'll let you catch a breath. Before, I'm good. Before we get to the shoot-around breath, let's make sure we understand what the poor Cleveland Cavaliers are going through. Because the poor Cleveland Cavaliers had a chance to win the other night in Sacramento, and then this happened. Yeah. All right, we didn't quite have that ready yet, so we'll wait and get that for you another time later in the broadcast. We'll we'll get it for you, but they literally, basically, the Christian Leitner play as close to it as you get in the NBA. Really? As an inbound went three quarters court to Harrison Barnes on the right side with point like six seconds left after Colin Sexton seemingly won the game. And if they'd done that, we'd be talking about the Cavaliers being eight and seven in their last 15 games. And instead, we're going to talk about them having lost a bunch of games in a row. So a little heartbreaking there on their part. All right, Ron Boone, what is the shoot-around report today? Well, with a, with a team like this, David, spacing is going to be the key. And they want to space and attack in a ball game like this. And when you attack with spacing, you're going to get the threes that you, that you need to get. Uh, Cleveland's going to throw different coverages at you, and I think they're a little concerned with about that, meaning we have to recognize those, those coverages and, and take care of that. Garland and Sexton, both of those guys like the mid-range within 10 feet, and so the Jazz are going to have to uh, uh, just keep those speedy guys in the backcourt from, from getting up kind of You know what's interesting about both of them, Ron, is they're both really getting better and developing. No. Neither of them is good in isolation, and neither of them is good going left, which is interesting. Like, you kind of get, and I think what that is is they're both so young, right? Sexton is third year, Garland in his second. So they still have flaws in their game, right? They haven't fully developed their game all the way through yet. Yeah. You look at Donovan. Donovan has quickness and power. These guys have quickness and speed. So that's what they're relying on, that speed and that quickness to get the job done. Jazz and the Cavaliers coming up on the Jazz Radio Network. Some places have low prices, but at Smith's, we go 